Greetings, friends, and welcome to the Demo Me, JMAC, the Red Island Shaver. So glad to have you all aboard for the midweek shave. And yes, I'm wearing the Canadian Mafia shirt today because it is Canadian Mafia Day Wednesday. So we're going to have a great shave today. Get ready for the show. Get this shirt smelling all nice and uh, fragranced uh, in lieu of, or not in lieu, but in anticipation of the show tonight. So we'll get right into it with the uh, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Pre-Shave Cube. Get that on the face. Get ready to rock and roll this shave. So we're going to have a little fun today. Um, as you guys know, last week, uh, on Wednesday, I did my Magnificent 11 DEs. Uh, thanks so much for all the views on that. That video did really well. Picked up some new friends to the channel. So uh, thank you so much to the new friends that are uh, subscribed to the channel now. I really do appreciate it. So I thought for today, we'll start, we'll start picking away at that list and start using some razors of that list. So today is the Magnificent 11 Premium Choice, and that is the Curve Christopher Bradley in Stainless. And it's also going to be a Canadian Mafia show shave because we are using all the official products of the Canadian Mafia. Because why not? We're very excited about this soap. Uh, I know some people are starting to get it in the mail calls. So uh, initial initial uh, response out uh, the people that have got it so far really, really enjoy the scent on it. So very exciting. I figured I would do another shave with it. And uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna enjoy this one. So <laughs> here it is, guys. I have, I am so proud to be associated with this project. Just look at that label. I'm pretty sure the camera, yeah, and the light is picking that up. So these these are metallic labels. So they shine with the light. Very 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 cool. Love seeing Don Maple right there on the uh, on the label. Our official mascot, Don Maple. The Mafia Beaver. <laughs> so good. Oh, man, I love this scent. I so love the scent on this soap. It's uh, Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mal Le Parfum. So, so good. Going to use the official brush of the Canadian Mafia, which is the Simpsons Trafalgar T3. And in order for it to be the official brush of the Canadian Mafia, you have to win it from Mel over at BBS.Live, which isn't really a problem because I think almost everybody in the wet shaving community has won one of these from Mel. And if you haven't won one from him yet, just watch BBS.Live or keep an eye on their page because he's always giving these away. Get in here and do the load. Set notes on this, like I said, Lamella Le Parfum, which are cardamom, lavender, iris, vanilla, Oriental notes and woody notes, and Pete absolutely nailed it. This is, of course, made by Hendrix Classics and Company uh, in his top shelf base. Oh, so good. Scent strength off on the soap is like a solid, like solid six. It's good. It's nice ball banging. Uh, scent strength on the splash is about a good solid 20 out of 10. It is intense. So, so good. So, so good. And that looks like a... That looks like a good overloaded brush, I do believe. Get this uh, taken care of and put away. Also, a reminder, I do have a link down in the description box down below while I still have everybody's attention. Um, some of you know, most of you know, some of you may not know if you're new to the channel, newer to the hobby. Uh, one of our members is suffering with uh, peritoneal mes mesothelioma, and that is Kim Gray. So on July 2nd, there's going to be a special soap Released at the Razor Company for Kim. 100% of the proceeds are going to Kim. So keep an eye on the Razor Company for that coming up July 2nd, this Saturday. Also, there is a GoFundMe started by Brandon Shaves. Brandon Hay. I do have a link to the GoFundMe in the description box down below. If you feel so inclined to, uh, to donate to the GoFundMe. If the link doesn't work for some reason... Um, just search Brandon Hay or Brandon uh, Brandon Shaves. Uh, I'll include if I remember. I'll include his IG uh, in the description box as well because I know the IG link will work for sure. And uh, he has links to the GoFundMe all over his uh, Instagram page. So you know, if if you can any little bit, or if, you know, if you want to buy the soap, 
the soap set or the soap trifecta. So there is, there is going to be an ED. Actually, it's going to be quad if you really want. Uh, there's going to be a soap splash bomb and EDT. So you can you can pick and choose what you want. You can get the soap, soap only, splash only. Uh, get the bomb, get the splash and the soap, get the EDP, get all four. Yeah, the choice is yours. So yeah, there's definitely some options to uh, to help Kim. Kim is a great member of the community. Always positive, she's always supporting everyone. So uh, I'm definitely looking at uh, grabbing a set of Magic on the second. Actually, I'm gonna use my affiliate link money to uh, purchase that set. And uh, like I said, I can do it in confidence knowing that Jason is going to donate 100% of all proceeds uh, back to Kim. So, so that's really, really cool. And I know the community is going to uh, come out in spades, so I'll have to, uh, I'll have to make sure I'm up in time and on my TRC account, because that will sell out quick, I have a feeling. And I'll carry on with this lather. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. I absolutely love the scent on this. Pete absolutely nailed it. Absolutely nailed it. Uh... A lot of the guys in the Canadian Mafia, like the, the show members, are frag heads. They're really into frags. They all have Lamel Le Parfum, and they're all saying that this is damn near note for note Lamel Le Parfum. So, yeah, Pete got his hands on a really good oil. And he's offering it a great price, too. We should mention that, but didn't mention that on the last video. This is an ultra premium oil, very expensive. Uh, Pete could have charged more for this. He really could have, but he didn't because he wanted to make sure people had the opportunity to grab it. This soap, if you're purchasing it in the States from, say, the Razor Company, which is where it's available, if you, if you want to purchase that through my affiliate link in the description box below, that would be awesome. Just grab the Curve Stainless. Uh, so yeah, it's only 21 bucks for the soap, $22 for the splash, which is an 8% EDT splash, so... For 22 bucks, man, you can't go wrong. If you're purchasing it on the Canadian side, it's available at top of the chain. And it's going for $28 each. Which lines up with the exchange perfectly. So... Uh, so nice, so nice and slick. I got the C plate on this curve, 0.85 millimeter blade gap, 0 0.09 millimeters positive blade exposure. Second use, people's blade in here. Also known as the Wizomet Super Iridium. Love this blade. I have seven razors in the den right now. I have four carves, a Fat Boy, the MLS 21, and the Durkant. Every single one of them has a Wizomet in it. That's how much I love these blades. They just work so well through all my razors, which makes sense because all my razors kind of shave in that same vein. So you lather up for pass number two. Yeah, man, this soap scent is just bringing it. Oh, it's so good. So, so good. Uh, this was a perfect choice for my premium razor. I absolutely love the look of this, the feel. It just glides in the skin, that beautiful Argyle knurling. Such a great razor. Feels nice in the hand with the four inch handle. It's a hefty boy at 114 grams. It's real nice. Such a great shaver. And I'm so used to using the Christopher Bradley that it just feels intuitive to use it after using the Overlander and the Decant so much. Because this does have a steeper shave angle. All the curved Christopher Bradleys are a bit of a cap rider, uh, where the Overlander and the Decant both shave at a more traditional angle. But I've got so many shaves with this that it just feels, it's just intuitive. Feels good in the hand. I mean, it's easy to adjust on the fly either. You can feel if the blade's cutting or not doing its thing 
Oh, so good. This shave is just going so well. I'm in absolute heaven right now. Just the aromatherapy is just, it's just smacking me right in the face. Oh, I can't get enough of this scent. I'm, I'm really glad we went with this one. Uh, the boys were adamant that we go with this one. One of the top frags uh, of the last two years in any any list of any reviewer that has like a large platform, they all consistently say that La Mal de Parfum is one of the best fragrances. It only came out two years ago. Uh, nobody's done it in the soap set yet, which is one, another reason we wanted to do it. Um, for our first release, we wanted to bring something to you guys that hasn't been done yet. You know, there's lots of dupes out there. There's lots of great scents, but they've been done over and over again. So we thought, you know, if we could bring something new to the table, that'd be really cool. And, uh, yeah, we achieved that with this. Those pesky little hairs right in here. Which are the bane of my existence. Yeah, that's close enough. It'll dry right down to a nice BPS. Oh, it's just, this is just one of those shaves I don't want to end. Because I'm enjoying it so much. Oh man, I love this scent. It's so good. Yeah, and this is why I picked this as my premium razor. Such a good shaving razor. Definitely worthy to be on my list. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure it was on my 2021 list as my uh, premium choice as well. I don't think it's ever going to change. So nice. Let's get these last few stragglers right in here. There we go. Very, very good. That's going to dry down to a nice, 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 nice shave. Key is to not... The key is knowing when to uh, say enough is enough. You learn that with experience. I know right now my face is feeling really, really good. It's going to be mostly BBS all over. There's going to be a couple spots, maybe. There's going to be a few whiskers, but they're not going to. They're not going to impact anything. They're not going to rub on anything. They're not going to give me any irritation. So we'll just leave them be. And that way we don't risk over shaving and ruining. But at this point is a phenomenal shave. There, and that's it for the rinsing. I want to leave some of those nice butters on the face. This really is a good soap base from Hendrix Classics and Company. Uh, Pete's a great guy, so very pleased to do this soap with him. Get the lather out of my ear. It's really not an ideal place for uh, for lather, I don't think. All right. Oh yeah, face is still super slick, guys. I love, I just love that post-shave feeling on a good artisan soap. All right, so now we go for the good stuff. Like I said, guys, this is scented at 8% oil, and it is an alcohol-based splash. Another look at that label. This has the metallic label as well. Beautifully done. Label's done by Razor Ray. He did a fantastic job. Knocked it out of the park. And this is the good stuff right here. Oh man, this stuff is so strong. This this lasted like eight hours. No, not eight hours. Nine plus hours on me. I went to bed. I was still smelling it. Woke up the next morning. My pillow and my blanket smelled like Lamelle Le Parfum. I'm gonna try not to put too much on. And this got a really nice feel to it too. It's kind of kind of thick, kind of uh, viscous but with alcohol in it. It's a really, really good splash. This is uh, Pete's first foray at aftershave splashes, and he absolutely came up with a wonderful, wonderful recipe. Really, really enjoying his splash. We are gonna go for more. The hell with it. Oh, man, that smells so good. Oh, yeah, I can already tell you, BBS. BBS zone, folks. 20 minutes from now, there's not going to be a whisker popping up my face. 
Get some on the shirt so it'll off gas. Oh man, that's the shave, guys. That is the shave, and by the shave, I mean the shave. That was that was good. That was really good. There's a reason I said this razor is in my premium category. So that's going to do it for me, my friends. Thanks so much for spending some time out of your day with me. I always appreciate it. If you're new to the channel haven't hit that subscribe button, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Helps the channel grow. Helps our what shaming community grow and our content creator community grow. It's going to do it for me, but I'm going to see you guys tonight on the Canadian Mafia Show. Cannot wait to have a good time with all you guys in the comment section. So until that time, be safe, be kind to one another, have a great day, get better shave. We're going to see you later on tonight. Peace.